ramblings on life CFing. Rambling is essentially chatting, a practice that can be boundless and unconstrained, where thoughts drift like mature dandelion seeds carried by the wind, landing wherever they may. Each day, everyone encounters two doors, one leading to heaven, the other to hell. Whether we step towards heaven or descend into hell depends entirely on how we interact with the people and situations we face. Proper interactions can lead to a path filled with blooming flowers and bright prospects, whereas improper ones can make our journey difficult and mired in obstacles. Life subjects us to a daily examination, with each action and decision part of this ongoing test. The universe acts as the examiner, and our final destination is determined by the cumulative results of these daily evaluations. Excellence ensures a place in heaven, per performance, a descent into hell. Daily, we may encounter angels among those we interact with, even those we meet in online chat groups. Treating these angels with kindness and sincerity might swiftly turn our fortunes around, unlocking divine secrets. Conversely, treating them poorly could mean missing out on valuable opportunities and wonderful futures. The ultimate outcome of our lives is built brick by brick by our thoughts, words, and deeds throughout our existence. It's futile to hope for impunity after causing harm to someone or something. Punishment is inevitable, whether it's for a sarcastic remark, a disdainful look, or derogatory words. Some punishments are overt, but most are invisible and occur without our knowledge. For instance, we might miss out on precious opportunities or face unexpected obstacles and tasks that should have been straightforward. When analyzing a phenomenon, we must consider three fundamental factors— sentiment, reason, and nature. Some phenomena may align with sentiment but not reason or nature, and vice versa. There are situations where, despite lacking in reason and sentiment, they perfectly align with nature. Therefore, it's wise not to judge too quickly, as hasty judgments can lead to misunderstandings and harm, unless we've fully considered these three aspects. During a visit to Vanuatu, a Pacific Island nation, I discuss vegetarianism with Mr. Stephen, the person in charge of the Eastern Eden. He advocated for a meatless diet. When asked about pork, he maintained his stance against it. I shared my perspective, explaining that balance is a universal principle, akin to the law where positive and negative energies sum to zero. This principle of give and take ensures equilibrium. For instance, if someone has caused harm or taken advantage of others, they must balance it out, possibly through reincarnation as a pig, repaying their debts through their body and life. Eating meat, from this perspective, can be seen as an act of kindness, allowing these souls to settle their debts and escape the cycle of reincarnation in the animal realm, thus returning to human form. There's an endless array of principles and insights to learn and comprehend in life. One profound understanding I wish to share is the importance of never harming anyone. Avoid causing harm with words, actions, or even thoughts. Even if others harm us, it's crucial not to retaliate in kind. Speak kindly and refrain from harsh words, as they can lead to irreversible consequences. Fish thrive in water, and humans thrive in Tao, the way. All phenomena and changes in the vast world operate within Tao, and no one is wronged without cause. Feeling wrong stems from a lack of understanding of cause and effect. Recognizing this principle reveals that everything is as it should be, and the universe operates with impeccable justice. Thus, if someone harms us, we should let Tao handle it, ensuring we never harm anyone in return. May 23, 2018 ChatGPT can make mistakes. Consider checking important information.